Well, it seems that the fans are rallying around. It was a little rough earlier uh, in the night. Uh, Cutthro Cody didn't appreciate some of the jeers as he was trying to express his feelings. That was very out of character for Cutthro Cody, at least recent character the last several years of Cutthro Cody. Ever since Death Proof was essentially born at the 10th anniversary show, I'm getting years confused, 10th yeah. anniversary show, which featured a match against the Hater Nation Sugar Brown was a part of. You know, you got you got to see and talk about, we continually say about how great the FSW Tag Team Division is, and the bottom line is, who would think that these two guys would be in a match and it wouldn't be for the FSW Championships? Again, it shows how deep the division is. This is a best of three series. And Clutch is reminding everybody about when they were both rookies breaking in, Jacob Boston Young was battling for the rookie of the year and Clutch, as usual, felt slighted and came in and basically almost broke the neck, the neck of Jacob Boston Young. Well, Clutch is constantly feeling slighted. Him and Shogun definitely felt slighted for a long time here. They were complaining about not getting title shots the whole time. Them and Death Proof were out of war. They're claiming they deserve the title shot tonight instead of Sky High. You know, you got that pre-game, uh, the, the, the pre-show uh, before the match starts with Clutch heckling the fans and yelling at them. Uh, and Jacob Austin Young using the, the speed and quickness, you know, a little bit of that Japanese style. Jacob Austin Young, great technical wrestler. Well, if, if Jacob Austin Young can keep this more technical, he can keep the match moving, he should be able to get the control over Clutch, who's a great athlete himself, but Jacob Austin Young would definitely have the speed edge. Oh. And he just popped Clutch in the back of the head. Well, maybe that'll cause Clutch to shut his mouth. Look at that. A crucifix submission. He's got Clutch standing. And as he yanks on the shoulder and head scissors the next. And this would be an amazing first match if Jacob Austin Young won it already. Clutch does not like being shown up. Shug trying to be the voice of reason at this point. That's happened in my office many times. I believe it. Many times, Jake. I absolutely believe it. It's not a cage match like last time. Weapons like that are not legal. I mean, I wish they were, but they're not. And right now, Sugar Brown, I believe, has helped Calm down Clutch a little bit. Clutch still upset about the disrespect shown by Jacob Austin Young, but the amount of disrespect Clutch has shown people through the years, he's got to expect it. And here you got Sugar Brown and Clutch and uh, Cutthroat Cody, you know, whether it was the following, the Hater Nation, Sugar Brown and Clutch, these two have been at it for close to 10 years. Yeah. They do not like each other. They've never seen eye to eye. Oh, look at that. Sugar runs through Cutthroat Cody. But despite the anger, and despite what is going on between the two, both teams respect the abilities of the other. They respect their abilities, but there's not going to be any signs of that in this match here. Because both these teams believe they should be at the top. They should be at the top of the mountain, the king of the hill in the tag team division. You know, these guys know if they fought 10 times, one team might win six, and that's why they're going two out of three. They want to know for sure. Oh, Hurricane Shug. The tilt the whirl clothesline, and down goes Cody, and he's setting up for sweetness. Cody's felt sweetness many times. He know that could have been the end of this matchup. And look at that, here comes Clutch out of nowhere. No tag made, Clutch thought he could catch him by surprise, but he gets low bridged. What does Young have planned here? And the, and the side kick from Jacob Austin Young. 
Obviously, they see a plan to isolate Sugar, but Clutch doesn't let their plan come to fruition. Oh, right into the set. Right into the set goes Cody. But the, the TV deserved that. And this night has just been out of control. Thankfully, uh, no equipment has been destroyed on the set. Yeah, no equipment has lost its lives yet. Can't say the same about Cutthroat Cody with whatever clutch has planned here. Uh, and Sugar Brown driving the knee. And right now, Cody in big trouble. One, two. But we know Cutthroat Cody is going to take a lot more than that to pin him. Yeah, Cody has a great pain tolerance. You really have to work him over to try to get the victory. You know, and this is a big matchup. It's best two out of three. Whoever could jump out 1-0. Yeah, it's a best of three series. This isn't a two out of three falls match for anyone confused. Oh, and once again, Clutch trying to shove the money. Cody doesn't like to eat those type of greens. Oh, and look at that drive in the elbow. The cover, one, two. Now Clutch just mocking the heart of Cody. The one thing that you can't doubt about Cutthroat Cody is his heart. Oh. Oh, and look at these two, toe-to-toe. -to -toe. Exchanging slaps, they're going world star. Oh, right to the back. And there that is, that slingshot stump. Trying to drive a hole through the chest of Cutthroat Cody. And you can just see the, the anger in these two teams fighting. There's no feeling out process. They know each other so well, they know. Now you gotta go full board with the intensity. It's like if they're in a movie, they're going right to the ending. Hell yeah, that's the way we like it sometimes. No build up. Don't need it. And the jawbreaker from Cody, but look at that. Sugar Brown catches Cody before he's able to escape and make the tag. And now here comes Clutch. Seems like a more calmed down version of him. Oh, Cody hits the double DDT here. Throw both their heads right into the mat. Got himself an opening, but he's got to tag in Jacob Austin Young. And Cody, he is crawling. But look at Clutch smartly grabbing a hold of Co Cody's legs. Oh, and that is just how well RMB work together. And Sugar Brown was able at the last second to grab the leg of Jacob Austin Young, so the tag could not be made. And now the punishment on Cutthroat Cody continues as Clutch has got him up. Just wedges him in between the buckles, almost like a chair. And right now, Sugar Brown loves driving that knee and he connects once again right into the midsection of Cutthroat Cody, who is in big trouble and needs to make a tag and he was that close to making it, but the RMB stopped it. Well, looks like we're going to the bank, Joe. High up in the air, connects. Oh no, but he left himself too open. Cody, can't tell from my vantage point what he's got locked in, but Clutch was in a lot of trouble, so much trouble, Sugar realized he had to break that up quickly. But I'll tell you what, lucky we had a good referee there, he might have counted three. And, and Jacob Austin Young begging for the tag. Chanted for Cody. 
And Sugar Brown, oh, oh look at no. that. Sugar Brown crash and burn. Cody got out of the way at the right time, but finds himself still have to deal with Clutch. And Jacob, Ambulance chaser. And Jacob Austin Young was looking for the tag while Cody was up. And once again, the crowd getting behind Death Proof. It looks like this is Cody's best opportunity to make the tag. You know, and the bottom line is all the work that these teams have put in. RMV has their fans. The Unguided have their fans. Death Proof has their fans. You know, you, you can't tell the fans who they want to cheer for. They all got their favorites. And we just have a slugfest. Men exchanging shots. Sugar sends him off. Jay Wilson Young off the ropes hard, hits the Hurricane Rana. And he ran in with that knife edge. Tornado DDT. And Jacob Austin Young. Oh, and look at this. He's performing it on Sugar Brown. He almost had clutch earlier, but very briefly had that octopus hold in. But trying to take care of Clutch, left himself open for Sugar to get a grip. Release. Suplex and Jacob Austin Young just absorbed it somehow. German with a bridge here. And there was only a two count, but if you didn't see it, Clutch just came by over here to grab the money bag. Yeah, I don't think any cameras caught it. And, and Cody didn't catch it as he slid right behind him. Yeah, Clutch was lurking near our announce table. And look at that. Cody makes the tag himself as Jacob Austin Young. He's perched on the second rope. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Cody up on top. Oh! They clutched that money bag. It's the same money bag they used to put away the bad bitches at Day of Reckoning. And there's the Brinks truck. Back it up for the Brinks truck. Your winners, the Real Money Brothers. And match number one goes to the R&B. Well, they jump ahead in the series, the best of three series. So if they can win the next one, they win it. And Death Proof would have to win two in a row at this point.